How's it going? Coming to you from the top of my town. Best spot in town. You can see the whole town. And I got my own personal little racetrack right here that goes all the way around. All over across a bridge. It's pretty cool. Anyway, love coming up here. Uh, figured I'd show you guys this build. I didn't make a video on it yet. And I really like it. And I figured it'd be worth making a video on. Really old Schwinn. This is one of the few I have where I'm not 100% on the year because it's got an aftermarket paint job. And I don't know the spot where the year would be. But, uh, where, where does it say? Right there. So the word Schwinn on it. So I was like, I want it. And, uh, it could use a paint job, a little fresh coat. Probably do the same pattern and colors, but a higher quality paint. I would love to do that for this bike. And, uh, came with two stickers on it. This might, I love when bikes come with stickers. Uh, Got that one, which I don't mind. And we got this one right here, which is pretty cool, pretty neat. Gives it a little character. So when I paint it, I'll be sure to preserve those. And uh, I didn't do much to this after I got it. I got it with no chain, so I went and got a nice fresh chain for it. And then uh, I put a ch children's sprocket to make this chain fit because uh, it did not come long enough, surprisingly. It was for a children's bike, so that was fun. Um, otherwise this is all spare parts from different miscellaneous engines I've had over the years and I finally had enough to compile them into one engine that makes noises and does stuff so I was like yes <laughs> and uh, yeah I don't really uh, have too much crazy to say about this other than what you'll probably be able to see just by looking at it I mean the carb I took a chunk of stock exhaust cut it off the end and tapped it over the carb housing to add that little feature don't know why i just i like it put a banana pipe on here i actually really like the way that sounds with this uh unfortunately it goes right back into the frame so eventually i'll be fixing that i'll be putting a little better downspout on it than the ones that come stock because they come stock with a little thing that points down but it was too narrow it wasn't letting enough pressure out so i had to lob her off uh she's a little dirty she could use a cleaning but uh it's a pretty sweet bike be happy with the way this all turned out and uh i don't know if i'd ever sell this one i think it's probably one of my favorites something about the way it looks but it still needs a bit of love trust me i'll uh i gotta get to it like that front fork isn't the original obviously the original uh is damaged i still have it but see if i can't get that fixed eventually it needs to be welded and then all the bolts aren't in the sprocket so if it needs a better sprocket eventually i want to get one of them hub centric mounts i want to get one for all my bikes but shit's expensive <laughs> so yeah i'll uh, add a little clip of it running and i'll rev her up so you can hear what the uh what it sounds like i bet you can guess though <laughs> 